The demonstration is a transfer outfit for your male character that will lose your outfit. So I'll link a transfer tutorial how it works for all change. So go watch the video if you guys do anything else. And explain how transfer glitch works on male character on all gen. So watch the video right now. From here, once you got that done, you all log into your male character. It should be in the first slot. If we don't have it in the first slot, I believe it won't work. I'm not sure it's another method. Uh, if you have it on a different slot, I think there is it on YouTube. But yeah. You may want to select an outfit to keep because transfer grid loses all your outfits except the one you have on. You may open your pause menu and select swap character. Be, this will be on Ojin. I believe Nujin is something different. So you just to watch the Nujin method on YouTube. So yeah, there is a met transfer glitch method for Nujin on YouTube. Go, so go watch it. You may want to have your male character in the first slot. Then create a new character in the second slot. And make that new character as a, a female, okay? So yeah, you could cop, you could cop a ring if it lets you, but yeah, this helps us unlock some extra stuff like shoes and stuff. So you won't try to make outfits. All right, from it, you should be the first option to change your sex to a female, so change it. All right, from it, you want to save and continue. All right. Like always, see you guys want to load into the lobby with my female character. Alright guys, if the console doesn't pop up on your map, just find a new session. Alright, from there, once you find a new session, head to the console. All components will be shown in the video, also in the description. Alright, for the first outfit component, I'm going to go to the top section and go down to tank tops. I'm going to select the mocha torn short crop, which should be number 61. All right, we can select that. Back out of the tops, go over to the pants. Go to leather pants and select the red ribbon. Should be number 40. All right, we can select those. From here, back out, go to shoes. Go down to high heels boots and select the gray cat suit heels. Should be number five. All right, we're going to back out, go down to shoot uh, accessories, go to gloves, and select the blue such a gold gloves, should be number 52. All right, from there, what you want to do now is just save your outfit in slot one. From there, once you got that done, you want to keep outfit one. Now we just change the top and the gloves for outfit two. Everything else, the pants and the shoes, stay the same. So you go down to the tops, go to leather jackets, and select the blue crappie biker. Should be, should be number 86. This should be the component for the trash vest. Alright. We're going to go down to tuck the t shirts. And basically, you want to select the black classic. Should be number 11. All right, we're gonna select that. From there, back out. Go down to accessories. We're gonna select is the merging gloves. So we're gonna go to gloves and select the red and gray armor gloves. Should be number five. After that, you select that. We first want the outfit two. Now you're gonna set your outfit in slot two. And make sure you got everything right and good to go. Now we're going to do the transfer glitch part. If you do not do the part after you save your components, you will go watch the video in the description for old gen. For new gen, look up a video on YouTube. But yeah, see you guys after I transfer my components. I want you to do the transfer glitch part and you spawn your mail character. You should want to save your outfit that you have on and check the component transfer over. So yeah, we got it. Now you want to go to the front counter, go down to GT5 Anniversary Outfits, and select the homey one. So it should be the first one. The grammar is the top. Now open your pause menu, go to online, jobs, play jobs, bookmark. You want to bookmark this mission, the Lamar missions. There will be two missions on the components in the description. You want to bookmark it. Once you bookmark the mission, you want to find a new, find a new session, and it should be there. All right? But you have the mission bookmark it, but we've been using the mission for the past two months. But yeah, once you have a job, you want to start off the mission. Once you load into the job, put the coin to play safe outfits, confirm settings, and then like like a friend to join you. So yeah, see so you guys when someone join and then start it up.
Once you start the job, go twice to the right to the to march your components. March to the first component with the gloves and the pads and the shoes, and then the second with the trash vest. All right, now we're gonna ready up and wait for your teammate to ready up as well. Kind of cool out. You get the like the green and the orange and the white theme. Kind of cool. So yeah, and the cool the dialogue pads. You may head over to one of your apartments and you want to save your outfit. So go to the left side and enter in a street vehicle in the parking lot. And to tell your friend to stay still. Alright, so yeah, see you guys. Alright, if you guys can't enter your apartment, get out any explosives and kill yourself in the game. Alright. But if you guys could get through your apartment, that's good, right? For me, once you're in your apartment, go to your closet area. It should be up or downstairs. You want to save your outfit in the slot and then leave the mission. Alright, so yeah. So you guys want to spawn in the lobby. Alright, you should spawn with the homing outfit, but we save our modded outfit in the slot in the mission. So check your slot and save it as mod. Look at that, we got it. We also get like orange save, save on our outfit. Now we're gonna add is a helmet or a hat or a mask or an outfit. So yeah. Our right, head is the clone, so go to the hat section. You want to select any hat or helmet or bulletproof helmet or adversary helmet that you have put on. We do the telescope glitch to transfer the helmet onto our money outfit. So we're gonna run past the telescope and see if you press around the D pad and you notice the character should stop and your mask or your hat should stay put. So, so put on your money outfit that we save. And boom, we got it. Now we want to save your outfit again and then we put on a mask and do the same method to add the mask onto the helmet or hat. Alright, so yeah, I'm going to save my outfit first. I'm going to head to the mask door. So I'm going to go to the masks and go down to ski masks and let's select this. So you can select any type of mask of your choice. So I'm going to select this, the white tight ski. Alright, and then do the telescope method again. The same method that we did just now. So we're gonna run past the telescope and see a pressure on the D-pad. So I got it on the second try. So I'm gonna do it again. Press on the D-pad, boom. I can't just stop on the mask will stay. So put on my outfit that we just saved right now, and boom, we got it. Now you get to save your outfit and then change something on your outfit, get like an orange look save. But yeah, like and subscribe for more money outfits. We're on the road to 5k subs. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Like always, it's your boy. Ice Cream Mods, I'm out. Peace.